<laughs> Welcome you guys to another chuckling tutorial and this time it's going to be about chuckling three ring back shoulder rolls uh, this trick Okay, so there are two tips for this trick to work it's the same as back crosses or any body throw trick Okay, there's just one one small difference Okay, I'm gonna draw it for you so you can see better. This is your head. Okay, uh, these are like your shoulders. And you're looking that way. Okay, this is from above. Okay, so the rings, when they come, when you juggle, you start from here. And you go, hang on. You go behind the back. So this, uh, the angle that it comes over the shoulder, that's a key point. So it comes in this angle. Okay, got it. usually people tr turn it this way when they throw, like a normal back cross. But this is not, it's better to throw it this way. Okay, so what it looks like from the side, see what I mean? So you don't turn it this way, it actually goes that way. So when you go in, So the angle is the same, it goes behind the back and then front, okay? So that's one tip. Next one is, you make it spin. So you give it, you lift it upwards and you spin the ring actually. So it starts to spin like this way. And that's what makes it go turn uh, top, okay? So it goes up, spins and then it comes down. Okay, that's pretty much the two, two biggest secret that there is for the trick. And the same thing that you learn is you first you learn, first you learn with one ring, just to do this. And try to do it, yeah, a little bit more and a spin, yeah, like that. And how do you catch it? Is just wait. And you catch it from the upper, so you put your hand into the hole, okay? Like that. Calm down, put your hand into the hole. So it's straight to throw again, okay? And then you learn that with one, and try to keep your body, body straight. So you don't go like that, and then throw here and here, or you wiggle a lot. There's gonna be, at least for me, my shoulders go a little bit like that when I do it with three. But that's all, so you don't... Try it with one ring, just to stay up straight, okay? As straight as possible. Okay? Cool. And then with two, again, uh, first you do the back, and then normal throw. And that is like, I hate that. I think it's easier to do three than with just one. But, uh, like one back throws and two normal throws. But that's a good way to learn, because you have to be really it's painful, okay? And then the other way, you first you throw, and then you back cross. This is actually a lot easier, but it's very good to learn. And in here, you start to do the 12 time exercise. How long do you hold the props in your hand? So you try to throw as late as you can, okay? So you throw as late as you can. This is how you buy yourself time into the, in the three, ball, uh, three ring pattern, sorry. So you practice doing it as slow as you can. Because that's why when you do it with three, usually uh, you run out of time. So when you practice it with two, to be slowly, to do slowly, to be slow, then you have more time in your three, three ring pattern. Okay, hope that makes sense. So when you start with three, it's the same as any other. Like first you do it with one hand, then with the other, then you go one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, and just build up. Okay, but the toes, the angle thing, and you make it spin. Those are the two biggest ones. Okay, and then one more thing, when you go the other way, it's the same thing. Uh, here, the angle doesn't matter so much. We're gonna go like that. <laughs> okay, so when you go to the other way, you throw it on your shoulder, and again, the you don't throw it to the shoulder, you throw it from uh, below, you throw up, and you put it in the spin. Yeah. 
I can do it with three, but not with one. Okay, so you get that. And you have to make it spin. So it spins up and then it turns. Okay? And this is your catch as a penguin inside of the ring. Okay, here the angle you can go that way. It doesn't matter. You can be the angle, it's much more forgiving on this trick. But the reverse is easier that way. This angle. Okay? So, but it is again, you go down, you throw up, and you put it spin. Wait, you put some spin to it. So you go down, add some spin. Okay. And that's how you should be able to do it. Okay, hope that helps. Give it a try. If you have questions, post them there so I will know. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, See you next time.